Hello, strangers on the internet. Once again, how are you doing? And welcome back to the absolutely amazing Minecraft Survival. Hosted by me, Gavstar. And as you can see behind me, I did a lot of work off camera. And I built an entirely new house that I would love to show all of you out there. So without further ado, let's go. As you can see, off camera I got a lot of diamonds. See all the 64 diamond blocks. I upgraded my furnaces. I have villagers. I have all that stuff. And now I have an upstairs with all my beds and books. But I can't read them, which kind of sucks. I also have a massive netherite beacon on the top of my house. And a bubble elevator that's fully automatic. And as we travel down here, there is a room made completely out of netherite. There's all my enchantment tables. Oh my god. I have this guy in here. I I'm gonna die. I'm hungry, so yep, I'll eat that. Okay. I should have gotten one another I got for armor. Okay, whatever. Anyways, I also have a lot of chests back here. As you can see, they're all filled with blocks of netherite. And they hear another zombie somewhere. Now finally, I would like to give you the last part of the house tour, which is down here. As you can see, I have a fully automated fire resistance and, lucky enough, an end portal I found down here earlier. I remodeled the room. Wait, that's illegal! So let's go in and let me show you the final part. It's absolutely beautiful. I have this massive path leading all the way over to where I killed the Ender Dragon. I also did that off camera. So as you can see, this is the area. Um, there's a beautiful egg right there on top. Proofs I defeated it. Heads. Head. 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 Yep, all heads. And finally, this beautiful test with all this beautiful stuff. And the stupid Enderman who's trying to kill me. You're ruining my moment! Oh. Now I'd like to show you guys the most powerful weapon in the entire world. Are you ready? Get away! Are you ready, guys? Um, my recording was just completely ruined by this guy. Oh my god! Anyways, alright, so this is the ultimate weapon right here. I am Confucian! Now you see, it is named God, even though you cannot see it, but this is God's weapon. Yeah, I managed to get this off camera too, so we're gonna probably try to slay something with this amazing netherite bow. I mean God. So yeah, get to see how powerful it is. <laughs> Who needs a sword when you have a hoe? Am I right, guys? Yeah, see, this guy isn't even attacking me because he's too afraid of the hoe. So, we'll go in the portal, back home, and yeah, that's a tour of my new amazing house. So, guys, hey, the Enderman's here. Oh No. No. You're kidding me! Oh god! Save me! Oh my friggin' god! No! God! No! No. The holy name is God. Hello 
guys. For real this time. That intro was totally a troll. Just act like nothing ever happened. Well, as you can see, I did absolutely nothing off camera, and I didn't accomplish a single thing in my life. You know... All I've accomplished is just getting iron and... Well, glass that I'll probably never use. But hey! That is completely fine. And I took my armor off. So yeah! I would like to inform you all that- Why did I take that off? I'd like to inform all of you that, um, unfortunately for you guys, but luckily for me, the last of you did not get 69 dislikes or 69 likes, which I am pretty happy about. But, it did get likes, and it got zero dislikes, so I'll make an exception. Since I'm happy about that, I will tell you guys this. If this video reaches 10 likes, I, I will craft Satan. So yeah! Keep that in mind while you're watching the rest of this video. So since I did absolutely nothing off camera, I haven't accomplished anything. So I'm probably going to have to go mining. Well, I guess that's the first step, people. I'm gonna find a good cave, and well, I'm gonna mine in it. Cause isn't that like the point of Minecraft, to mine? Or, or what did I call it yesterday? Block game, yeah. The point of block game is to mine. So, so let's mine. That, that sounds like lots of fun. Okay, well I meet you guys back when I find a good cave to mine in. Okay people, so I've officially found a ravine, like right outside my house, so... Yeah, we're gonna search this place. I have no idea if it has any other caves. Whatever! Oh god, I remember the last episode when I tried jumping in like a water ravine like this, I almost died. In okay, anyways, um, I should probably get stone because... Oh my god! I am an idiot. Wow. I'm so good at Minecraft. You know, I, I should be like famous for being so good at Minecraft, you know? Okay, so I'm gonna mine this coal because I'm gonna need this. Alright. I'm gonna craft this. Okay. There's a creeper. Hello. Oh yeah, I also made a shield. Um, last time I really struggled with trying to make a shield because I'm an idiot. I remember trying to craft it like three times. Oh wait, we should probably get some of this iron. I know I have a lot of iron right now, but, you know, it's a survival. You're supposed to waste some. Ooh! Oh god! Okay. Wow. I just outplayed him. Woohoo! But more importantly, let's see. We found an inside ravine. I did not expect to find this. Okay, okay, what do you guys think? Should I try jumping down there? Landing in that water. Let's see. 360! Oh my god! Coming to get revenge, huh? Actually, this guy's probably a different guy. But hey, what why are we? 13, okay. Diamond time. Will we find diamonds this fast? I mean, we already have diamonds, but like... We're saving those for a specific reason. Just in case. So... There's gold. I like gold. I don't know why people throw so much hate on gold. I, 
I just like how I can just go into any random topic when I say it in, like a normal word. Like how many of you guys saw that coming? Um, you know, me complaining about mobile like in gold. Whatever! You can use it to make all kinds of stuff like golden apples. And, you know, to be fair, I could um, really use that right now. Because like I almost die like so many times. Golden apples are like totems of my family. They're your last resort. Okay, um, no diamonds, but hey, obviously I didn't expect to find any anyways, so, um, I'm used to disappointment. No, I won't speed bridge, because I'm not an, id an idiot. Which reminds me, I wonder if I should try doing a video on, like, Bed Wars. Fun fact, I haven't played that game in six years. Why? Well, it's because I don't have any friends to play it with. And also because I just got onto PC Minecraft like eight months ago. Yes, I've lived without playing PC Minecraft for, like, eight years. You know, I used to be a console player. I know, right? You know, everybody has like a weird origin story. I wasn't always this bad at playing Minecraft. Well, I'm not that bad. I don't know, you people want to insult me in the comments? What am I doing wrong right now? Oh god. Okay. Ha, ha, what? You guys saw that, right? He just fired out of his butt. <laughs> oh my god. I'm just gonna eat this cook pork chop. There's a creeper over there. Wait, can I get a music disc? Hold on. I kind of wanted a music disc. You know, I was going for disc 11. And that poor bat's on fire. Oh my god! Okay, okay. So let's try going. Oh! You're kidding me. I fell backwards. Okay. I'm just gonna go up. What was I doing? I was originally trying to get out of here. I guess dying was a faster way of doing that. Okay, I don't know what's happening today. But hey, what you guys thought was gonna happen never did happen, did it? I got lucky. Usually I don't have a lot of luck. I'm holding down the wrong key. Once again, my shift and sprint buttons are the worst. Could be something over there. Estimated level. Not low enough for diamonds. I think this place sucks and we should find a new place to go to. So yeah, I'm gonna find that. Alright, I'm gonna get this Enderman right here. Okay. 
Yeah, people, I found an Enderman on the way. I had to pause the video. But I probably should have put that guy in the boat. Sir! Wow. Well, people, I'm... Uh, this is not going well at all. Okay, people. So I am indeed back. I got my armor back, but I didn't get the gold back, obviously. But hey, that cave sucked anyways. And I sucked too. So... Um, yeah, let's, um, find a better cave, because, oh my god. Actually, I think there's a cave right here. Um, so we're gonna go down, we're gonna see if we can get, wait. Before we go off and be idiots, so before I be an idiot, I almost forgot, I don't have any food. Well, get ready for a food montage. a good collection of food, as you saw in the montage. So, yeah, basically, now let's try going to mine again. Let's try going... I don't know how to phrase that. Well, as you saw, I found a couple other caves. There's actually a ton of caves. Um, I don't really want to go down that one because it has lava in it, so it's probably a bad sign. So let's try going in this cave, for now. It actually looks pretty small. I wonder if I'll die again.
And I just realized, if I really want to find diamonds and make it as efficient as possible, I should get Fortune 3. Now I'm pretty sure you guys all know what that enchantment is, right? Yeah? Yes? No? Maybe so? Nope. Well, well, I don't know what you guys are thinking right now. You know, I wish I could read your minds, but I can't. But I'm sure you do anyways. Well, let's just keep it at that. So yeah, Fortune 3. If I have Fortune 3, I can get multiple diamonds from one diamond. Simple exclamation. Yep. There you go. Alright. Okay, this cave looks good. How about this? How about I waste hours of my day trying to get Fortune 3? Okay, people, and instead of just keeping you there with me to suffer, I'm going to once again do another amazing montage. It's going to be called the Fortune 3 Montage. What a creative name. Yes! Oh my god. That took absolutely forever! And it costs 45 emeralds. Oh my god. Oh my, I gotta make sure this guy doesn't die, so... He's gonna stay in there. Oh, but as you can see, guys, I totally forgot that I didn't have a lectern in this village. So I had to get sugarcane. On camera. Wow, how amazing, right? It looks like, how many emeralds do we have? We have 18. Oh my god. Okay. What is the easiest way to get emeralds? I want to know. And I think I might already know. Easiest way to get emeralds is by getting a stone cutter. So I'm gonna go ahead and get myself a stone cutter. 
So people, I've officially gotten the Legendary Stonecutter. So if you don't know why I'm making this, I'm making this because... One of the best trades in the game that provides you with loads of emeralds is a trade for clay. Yeah, clay. If you get like a certain amount of clay, you know, you can get emeralds for it. Now this may sound pretty simple, and it is. See? 10 clay for an emerald. So, now we're gonna go on an amazing clay montage. I have done so many montages this video, I might as well name the entire video montage, right? You know, I'll think about that. And I just realized, I already have an iron shovel in stock. So I'm probably going to go mine clay until this breaks. So, once again, what number of montage are we on in this video so far? Um, I think we're on the third montage! Alright people, so I am officially back, and right now I'm searching for the stonecutter villager. Stone mason, that's what their name is, right? But yeah, I'm searching for him right now and I can't find him. And um, something's telling me somehow, somewhere, he died. Because usually when you can't find a villager, they're dead. It's either that or they're hiding. So now I have to play a game of hide and seek with them, and... What are you doing here? Actually, I have an idea. Yeah, that guy's llamas drop leads. Everybody kills a llama for the leads, it's amazing. But more importantly, I need your stuff. Good thing he's not dead. But he ran out of the trade. <laughs> How long must I wait? So. Okay, now I'm gonna wait. Um, what can I do while I'm waiting? Absolutely nothing, that's what I thought. Wait a minute, I can smell it. And sleep. But what? Wait, this guy is sleeping, why can't I sleep? Okay, we'll put those in there. Oh my god. Just go. It's your bed! 
Alright. I'm officially up. Like literally, I just got up on my chair. Um, hopefully this guy actually does his freaking job so I can trade with him. Do your job! No, don't run away from me. No, you haven't done your job. Why? Why? Do your job. That's that's not where your job is. Let's just stalk him until he does it. Guys, he's, he's not doing his job. What, what is your goal? Why? Why are you doing this? I want to understand the life of a villager. I really want to know what's going on inside their heads. You know, like, everything, everyone does something for a reason. What's your reason? Okay, you know, at this point, I'm just going to bring his station out. He's going to be forced to use it because of his binary code. Friend. Where are you? Use it. No! No! Dude! But your binary code! It's supposed to force you! Does it like not work day or something? Did I have days off? I don't know how this kid works. Why is there a second guy? Wait, actually. I don't know why there was a second guy, but, uh, he had the amount of emeralds we need anyway, so I'll take it, I'll take it. Alright, I just slammed my foot against the table. Wait a minute. We need a book. People, we're gonna have to grow an amazing sugarcane farm. I hope you're ready. Hope you're as excited as I am. All right, this is gonna be beautiful. We're speaking of farms, we need to build a farm eventually. Not right now, because I'm too lazy to. wondered how hard can you slam your space keyboard without breaking your computer that is oh my god I just feel so pathetic this is sad all right that's gonna be our sugarcane farm for now it looks pretty good Looks like it was made for midgets. Actually, is it midgeye? You know, because cacti, cactus, midgets, midgeye. Are you a midgeye? Are you serious? Are, are you freaking- you, you guys remember at the end of the montage, he had the trade. Why did he change his trade? Just when I thought the pain was over. You're a midgey. Well, people, well, I have to do this all over again, so, um, montage number four, I think. Alright people, 
start it again. I accidentally hit him. Well, wait a minute. It's actually cheaper than last time. You know what? You know what? That's okay. We have it. Alright. You're still staying trapped in there because I hate you. And because we're also going to need, um, Fortune 3 for our diamond pickaxe later. No, people, we're going to go back to the original goal. Which is... Um... To, you know, find diamonds. I mean, isn't that every Minecrafter's goal? I need one more iron to create an anvil. Give me a second. Alright people, I have enough iron to finally make this beautiful anvil. Aren't you guys so proud of me? It only took me absolutely forever to finally make this. So let's do it, you know, let's take a fresh new pickaxe. We have just enough iron to do that. Let's make this nice and preservative. Alright, new iron pickaxe. Three, two, one. We need to name it. What should we name it? I have to think. Um, what is something that says a lot about our society? Yes. You know, I have an idea. No, 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 no. This says a lot about our society right now. Alright, society pickaxe. Are you ready to accompany me on a mining mission for diamonds? Oh my god. Finally, let's go. Made it to the mouth of the cave. The possibly good cave that I found earlier. So we're gonna search and we're gonna find diamonds. How? Wait, what? Guys, how were silverfish? Is there a stronghold? I don't recall silverfish can spawn out of any stone. Can they? Um, guys, is this normal? Uh, tell me if I'm being an idiot, but I'm pretty sure those only spawn in strongholds. Unless... I don't think what I'm thinking is right, but... Maybe... Wait a minute. Emeralds! Cool. But... What if the stronghold is right here, actually? We can only spawn out of stone. I don't know. That was probably one of the weirdest things that, said that has ever happened to me. So, yeah. Um, that was strange. Um, I don't... Let's just ignore that it ever happened. And let's try getting this emerald. Emeralds get affected by Fortune 3, right? Oh, four emeralds. Yeah, they do. Um, well...
Alright, so people, I didn't really find anything in there at all. It was probably the most worthless trip of my entire life. As you can see, I almost died like twice. Um, I don't even know how I survived the second time. And I also ran into more silverfish, which I thought was super weird. I didn't find a stronghold. So, yeah, and I've encountered several baby zombies so far. Perfect. I've got lots of um, other stuff though, which is good. Not stuff I necessarily need. Um, and I just realized I lost the first ender pearl I got. monsters nearby. Alright. Oh, what are we gonna do now, guys? I don't know if we're gonna find diamonds. I just will just give up. officially started it. The strip mine. Caves have gotten us absolutely no luck. There is no use going into caves. Like, come on, seriously. You know, I've went into so many. I found absolutely nothing, you know, except death. So yeah, I'm finally going to do it. A strip mine. Next episode, this will be our key to victory. Strip mine. Well, people, I think that marks the end of this video. But the villager friend, I thought you were gonna do the outro. Well, whatever, ignore the villager. But as you can see, we made this amazing Fortune 3 pick, which took absolutely forever to make, and I absolutely never want to do it ever again. But it doesn't matter. So yes, exactly. We didn't find any diamonds, we only found death. This episode had way too many montages. But I don't care. Tomorrow we will strip mine in that mine over there behind me. But we will find diamonds, even if it takes me six hours. So yeah, people, I hope you don't die today. I hope nothing bad happens today. And goodbye. It's time to 